What up, everybody? I don't have much time to work with here because I I'm unable to clear data off my phone yet because I still have a another part of my Mario Odyssey playthrough uploading. So yeah, but nonetheless, uh, you know, I want to talk about Warriors games. You know, like Hyrule Warriors, um, Fire Emblem Warriors, stuff like that. At the end of the day, they're just Dynasty Warrior clones. But we have had some decent ones like Age of Calamity and then Three Hopes. Those were some great. You know, Dynasty Warrior clones or whatever. The first Fire Emblem Warrior sucked, and the first Hyrule Warrior sucked, but their sequels were amazing, and in many ways better than their mainline games. I'm just saying, I love Age of Calamity a hell of a lot more than I like Breath of the Wild. So yeah, we basically got the story that I would have wanted from Breath of the Wild, but didn't get. So, yeah. But nonetheless, I'm sitting there thinking like, what would be another great Nintendo franchise to turn into, like, a Warriors type of game? You know? Because when it's all said and done, the Warriors games pretty much resolve, revolve around, like, sword fighting and things like that, right? So, if they was going to make another, you know, Dynasty Warriors clone from a Nintendo franchise, what would be the best one to go with? They've already done it with Fire Emblem, they've already done it with Legend of Zelda, so what would be the next best one? Xenoblade. Yeah, I could see a Xenoblade, you know, Warriors type of game being a thing at some point in time. Because that's the other game that relies on swords and stuff like that. So, I can definitely see that one being one down the line. I'm surprised they haven't done it already, but whatever. Maybe it's something that will happen eventually, maybe not. My nephew was like... Oh, the next one's going to be Mario. I'm like, Mario has already got his spin off. He got the XCOM treatment, you know. So, yeah. Kirby don't have a spin off yet. Donkey Kong don't have a spin off yet. Star Fox don't have a spin off. There's a lot of Nintendo franchises that, that don't have a spin off yet. So, technically, they could do something like that with one of those other franchises. But again, I just don't see it happening because Dynasty Warriors has always been about sword fighting and axes and different types of, like, medieval type of weapons, you know. So I do believe that if we ever actually do get a new Warriors game, but being a Nintendo franchise instead, that it's going to wind up being Xenoblade. Because honestly, that's the only one I can think of that would make any kind of sense at this point. So, yeah. I just wanted to go ahead and talk about that because, I mean, I was never one for Dynasty Warriors. I thought it was boring and repetitive and everything, but I was able to get into that kind of franchise through stuff like Hyrule Warriors and Fire Emblem Warriors because I do like those games. <laughs> I know it's weird because at the end of the day, they're nothing but, you know, repetitive button mashers too, but they're still a whole lot more fun to play through than what the Dynasty Warriors games is. And maybe it's because we have more popular characters to play as. Maybe that's the reason why. I mean, in a Dynasty Warriors game, you just get basically a bunch of generic characters that are very forgettable and everything. But, you know, when you have Hyrule Warriors, yes, you're having, you have Zelda, you have Link, you know, maybe Skull Kid or Midna, you know, stuff like that. You get memorable characters. And the same thing when it comes to Fire Emblem, you know. We're all familiar with those characters. We're all familiar with the lore and story of their franchises. So that's the reason why those games seem so much better than Dynasty Warriors. Because we're more familiar with the characters and the story and everything. But when it comes to Dynasty Warriors, it's basically nothing but a bunch of generic, forgettable characters. A very forgettable story, if there's even a story at all. And, yeah. So that's the reason why me and so many others are willing to look past the whole repetitive button mashing nonsense when it comes to like Hyrule Warriors or Fire Emblem Warriors and that's the reason why I believe that a, that a Xenoblade Warriors would definitely be successful because again you know it's characters we'd be familiar with and uh you know it's a, it's a story we'd be familiar with another good one would be a Kingdom Hearts Warriors I'm just saying, Sora technically uses a blade, or Final Fantasy Warriors, something like that. There's a lot of good different franchises they can use that revolve around like sword fighting and things like that. Hell, a Soul, Soul Calibur, you know, Warriors could be a thing if they wanted to go that route. Just saying, there's a lot of good Warriors type of games they can make if they wanted to go with that route. So yeah. And that's all I got to say on it because I don't have much time to work with here. So yeah. Y'all take care. God bless. Peace.
And what are some games you think might be good for a Warriors title?